Bullets went flying just before 11 last night near the ocean front, striking storefronts near Atlantic Avenue and 21st Street. Business owners had to clean up broken glass and cover windows. Ten on your sides, Deanna Batneshi joins us live with how they're trying to get back to business as usual. Deanna. Well, we know that one of the businesses right here behind me, this is Beachwear for, for Less, and they had one of their windows broken last night, but it's since been fixed. It was fixed this afternoon. The owner tells me it cost about $1,000 to fix a window like that. She also tells me there was an employee and a customer inside the store when the gunfire started, but she's just glad they're safe. Window repair crews were called to the oceanfront to fix windows just like this one that were shattered by bullets near Atlantic Avenue and 21st Street just before 11 Monday night. Police say someone in a car and a man on the sidewalk by these businesses shot at each other, causing this damage at the oceanfront. There's someone standing on the sidewalk and they jumped in a car. Witness Sean Collins says he had just gotten married and went to go grab a drink at a bar nearby when he heard the bullets. Next thing you know, we walk into the bar and about 20 seconds later, we hear like pow, 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 pow. He says he went and jumped on his wife to shield her, and they heard another round of gunshots. He says once they stopped, they ran out of the bar. We went to the kitchen in the back and then ran out the other bar. He says his family was staying at the hotel across the street, and that's where they went and watched what was going on below. He gave us these pictures he took of the crime scene. He says his family has been staying at the oceanfront for years, but won't be coming back. Well, my right family is staying at the hotel across the street just trying to be tourist in a tourist city and they should have a reasonable expectation of safety when they're here. This is unacceptable. This type of activity is unacceptable and they, it's unacceptable that they can't feel safe. He tells me police arrived pretty quickly but says he would have liked to see a larger police presence near this strip of businesses. Now, there are surveillance cameras in the area, but police say the video won't be available because it's still an active investigation. Reporting live in Virginia Beach, Deanna Betaneshi, 10 on your side.